Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are doing very, very well. Thank you so, so much for joining me on another video. As you guys probably already know by now, Duran Duran have released a new single. So that actually came out, I think, a few hours ago. So it's literally brand new. I'm really excited to jump into it. We're going to react to it and do a little bit of a breakdown. But I really hope that you guys have had a chance to listen to it. Let me know what you think of it down in the comments section below. So yeah, I kind of have this vampire s vibe going on for this video you guys obviously know why i believe that this single is going to be part of duran duran's halloween album that they have been teasing quite a little bit with andy taylor from hearing the teaser so far i gather it's quite dancey has a little bit of that spookiness to it so i'm very keen to hear it to check it out i'm glad that i'm able to make a small video uh just in the meantime whilst i edit my medazzaland video because it is a huge video i swear it's probably three hours long. I don't know how it ended up being that long, but I have so much footage to get through. So it's going to take a wee while to come out to you guys, but I'll try my best to get it out to you as soon as possible, just with my busy schedule at the moment. So this is the cover for the single, very straightforward, a lovely black and red theme with a lovely white border. And then they have a dancing skeleton on the front cover, which I think is really, really cool. Let's jump into Dance Macabre. Oh, nice. That's sore. Hell yes. Halloween girl sees the fray. Brothers and sisters lead the way. Shackle to the rhythm, your soul is waved. So you better get down on your knees and pray. Oh, I love this. I wonder if they started playing this live as well. I'm not sure. I really love those harmonies and filtered vocals, but also there's like this ambience. The kick and the beat is very thumpy and very clean. Love it. No way. I had you down for the cat's pajamas. I think a couple of weeks ago they teased that uh, synth sound and it was really spooky and I was actually expecting something like really, really haunting. Um, and I'm just hearing that now in this song, which is really, really cool. And then what's really interesting is they've gone into this different section, which I wasn't really expecting. Sounds like a hi hat going through it, going tss, tss, tss. or it's an effect sound or something. I I really like that. It's almost like a bridge. Okay, that's my favorite part. That da 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 da. And then you hear the slow attack quiet. Oh my goodness. I love that. Yeah, hands down my favorite part.
like that. It's like female vocals and pitched vocals in the background saying, if you don't mind, if you don't mind. One of those layers is pitched down to sound very demonic. Interesting structure, definitely. And then a new synth sound coming in at the end there. Very cool. Very different too. Different to anything I've heard. But what do you guys think? Do you think that would have actually fit quite well on an album like Midazoland, for example? Because I just listened to Midazoland and it has that, obviously, that dark, moody kind of element to it. Look, my thoughts, I think it's quite catchy. It definitely makes me excited for what's to come from this album. The album is called Dance Macabre. My initial thoughts was that this entire album was going to be an album of originals, but from what I gathered, off Spotify it's going to mostly be a covers album with a few original songs so I'm looking forward to hearing something new and also hearing what they've done with the covers really awesome that they brought Andy and Warren back for this of course it's no surprise that I absolutely loved the pads in that track especially in that midsection where Nick was doing that da 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 and then that choir pad that just sends chills through you that was awesome so yeah, overall, I think this is really cool. Definitely check it out if you haven't already. Uh, but in the meantime, if you enjoyed this video and haven't seen my Duran Duran deep dive series yet, please go check it out. But in the meantime, guys, look after yourselves, stay safe, and I will see you again in the next video. Bye.